Hello, my friends. I'm Drillsfa, and this is really loud in my ears. All right, that's much better. All right, so I've been trying to do this a couple times. I haven't had much opportunity to record. Oh yeah, welcome back to Stray Cat Crossing, by the way. Um, I had to look up the controls again because it's been so long since I've played. I forgot that A was to jump. I remembered shift was to run, but this part I need to know how to jump. Because that was how I screwed up the first time. So, we are going to leave off right where we... I mean, we're going to start right where we left off. Yes! This... Oh, crap! <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is actually kind of tense! Oh, we actually made it on our first try. Well, technically not our first try. Don't forget me. Even if you don't like me anymore, please, don't forget me. It's you! You have my scarf! Cat! It's good to see you, sweetheart. How are you doing? They didn't like me anymore. Mommy was expecting them soon. Who's them? Oh, okay. The twins. So Mommy and Benny didn't need me anymore. So I left. That's why the twins are mad. Oh, are the twins the guys in the other room? The twins. Mommy and Benny. They all died. That escalated quickly. I killed- Okay, this is escalating very quickly. Cat. Sweetheart, I mean, I know I'm a mug, but we got our main character here. Cat, I need to get that scarf back. After what you just told you, that's your primary concern? I can get behind that. Oh, did they kicked us out. We need to go back in. This time, Cat's house. This time we don't go in the basement. I guess we go upstairs this time. Hey, Pico, it's me again. Pit picture? Yes. It's been so long since I played this game, I honestly don't remember that much about it, except that I suck at it. Let's just get around the house quicker. Actually, can we go upstairs and talk with this dude now? No crap. Not doing that again. Oh, he's gone now. And we can just explore. That's cool. Oh, hey! It's short! A baby doll. It's ragged and dusty. Yeah, you don't have any comments about earlier? You know, maybe the fact that, uh, they spell mom. Aww, I'm assuming they spelled dad. Aww, that's adorable. Depressing, but adorable. Whoa, this is just creepy. A mom, a dad, and a daughter. She's not smiling. So Cat was always a weird child. Oh, recently? This game reminds me, recently I went to go see The Boy with one of my friends, that horror movie, and like, it, I thought it was, I personally thought it was a good movie, I didn't see it as a scary movie, like, honestly it felt like watching a good student film, in my opinion, it was so good, but it was like, weird, it was like good, bad, but bad, good, if, if you know what I mean, like, it spent so much time setting up an opportunity to scare you that it forgets to scare you. If that makes any sense, you know? Just this game reminds me of it. And honestly, my friend thought it was hilarious. But part of me thought it was like... Kinda spooky, but kinda not spooky. Whatever, let's just move on to the Blay footprint room. Oh, the garden! Pico! And an owl! Cat! Not this again. I'm locked out. Come on, Pico. You and me, till the end. Oh, why is he- he's getting more confident with me. That's adorable. Hey, Owl, do you speak to me? Hoot hoot! Who can I tell me the time? Oh, what time is it? It's late. It's tea time. Okay, I was wrong. I'm sorry. It's not tea time. Hoot hoot! Who doesn't enjoy afternoon tea? Did I just screw with the time-space continuum? That's so weird, but this is so cool. What's this place? I can't get in. Oh, wait a minute. Dude, maybe the owl 
helps me out here. Maybe he does it. It's supper time. Maybe the owl controls the pond, depending on the time. That would be pretty cool. Who will be my dinner then? Oh, nope. <laughs> Not me. Don't eat Pico. Yay! It is supper time. What the frick are you? <laughs> what are you? You're like that face stealer from Avatar The Last Airbender. Or like the blue caterpillar. This is a very Alice in Wonderland-esque game. Back again, dearie. Excuse me? Have a seat, sweetie. I'll put on the kettle. I don't... <laughs> I don't know you. Sorry, but who are you? Who am I? Why? Who am I? Have you seen a little girl dressed in green around? Oh, do you mean little cat? No, I'm afraid I haven't seen her since the accident. What accident? I'm so worried about my poor baby. This is kind of weird, like, um... Not a good weird. Your baby? The spider. It's taken my baby. Please, bring my baby back, sweetums. Okay then, <laughs> whatever you want. Uh, I don't know what to name you, so... You know what I was in Wonderland was the blue caterpillar? You can be the purple caterpillar. Just a nice little um, slight contrast. Oh, back again, dearie. Have a seat, won't you? I'll put on the kettle. Okay, so I gotta find your baby then. I guess your baby is somewhere around the house. I'm locked out, but... Hold up. Yo! How do I find your baby? Do I need to talk to the owl again? I guess I should save before I lose everything that I've done. I don't know why, this game is just very... Sleepy. Like, it's a good game, it... But it's just very sleepy. Uncontrolled. Uh, right now it's bedtime. Who dares tell an owl to sleep at night? Not me. You do you, buddy. I don't judge. Yeah, now the bridge is gone. The only time we haven't done is, um... Lunchtime. Will lunchtime give us... The owl, I mean not the owl, the uh, spider. The spider took the caterpillar's baby. Oh, s lunch then supper. Or not. I guess I'm just dumb. These reeds are everywhere. Well, where do I go then? Sweetheart, you gotta give me a little direction. It's supper time. Because I need to talk to the caterpillar again. I need to figure out what I'm doing wrong. It will be dinner then. North Pond, South House. Gee, that helps when both signs are pointing east. Seriously, Caterpillar, what do I do? Oh, do I go around you? Oh, I'm an idiot. Sorry about that. Oh, you're creepy. I'm gonna talk to you in a second. You're kinda cool. I just love how Pico is so comfortable with me now. You're the cutest thing I've ever seen. No offense to everything else I've seen. Undertale's pretty cute, but Pico is just so, mm, so cute. Now, who are you? You're pretty neat. Ugh, I'm so angry. Why are you angry, buddy? Tea time. Tea calms everybody down. Who doesn't enjoy afternoon tea? Hopefully this guy enjoys it too. Ugh, I'm still angry. Why are you ain't? Hey! Rude! Come on, man, be cool! Who are you? What do you want? Um, items. Oh, maybe we give you the egg! Or we don't give you the egg. The egg's for something, I know that. Maybe you're lunchtime. I don't know what you are. 
I mean, you're kind of cool. You're like a ram. You're like, um... I don't know how to describe you, but you're still pretty cool. Well, explain to me why you're angry, and maybe I can help. Even Biko's confused. Who is this guy? I need to figure out a name. Let's try Ramsbert. Let's see if Ramsbert works. Hey, yo! Can you help me out with this? Back again, dearie. I'll put on the kettle. Well, I would appreciate it if you uh, help me out with this little dilemma that I've hit. Again. Because I'm so bad at this game. One of these times has to do something to this lad. Alright, we haven't tried bedtime. Maybe bedtime will put him to sleep. He's so dapper, but he's really short. He's like... I don't know. Are you still grumpy? Eh, you're still grumpy. What is your damage, dude? Hey, Pico, can you help me out with this guy? Maybe I climb over. Or maybe I have a way to go around. Can I just, like, grab, like, a stick? And kind of just, like, poke him away? Because seriously, I don't know what to do, and I've made- Whoa! Oh! This place is a clock! This dude is the center, and these are the hands! Oh my gosh! That's incredible! That's so clever! I take back everything bad I've said about this game, that's so smart! I'm sorry I didn't get it right away for those of you who noticed it immediately, you're, you're hyper intelligent, you deserve all the kudos. Oh, this is sad mu- Whoa! It's like a little Tokyo thing, it reminds me of a game I played a while ago called, um... Darn it, something darkness, into the darkness, not into the darkness, but something. GET OUT! Okay, someone's a little grumpy. I guess we'll come back later. You don't want me interrupting your peace. I get it. I feel the exact same way, buddy. So I'm just gonna go back. I'm gonna find the owl and I'm gonna find myself the time. Okay, so... What I need to do, I need to go back north because I don't want to screw this up. So, right now, what is it? They said it's... Bedtime. No, this is... No, supper time is six. Lunch. What time is lunch? I know this hand will always stay here. I know that. Because that's the zero hand. So right now it's nine. Is tea time... Is tea time the time that it just was? So, this hand always stays up north, so I always have an idea of where I am. Okay, so tea time is 3 in the afternoon. That's super interesting, okay. I'm getting a grip on it. This is the only direction we haven't gone, which means it's the only direction that has a way to progress. So, we gotta figure this out. Who's over here? Who's our last character? Whoa, hyper intense music. HELP! Hey, you! Me? Yeah, you! Ugly! Come over here! What is going on? Whoa! Another doll? Get me out of here! Um... Are you stupid or something? Hurry up, before they come back! Who do you mean by they? I guess that's our cue to figure out who. This is... I swear, this game is like a fever dream. <laughs> Fellas, look who decided to join for dinner. You've got a lot of nerve showing your faith around here. Finally, I've been getting tired of grubs. Are you the spider? A spider? Where? Are we the spider, she says. We're wolves, genius. Very hungry wolves. Um, do you mind if I take this thing here? Thing? Hey, spring! I know I keep alternating voices. Final voice for this guy, I promise. Do we mind if she takes that thing here? Oh, so they do have names. So spring is the green one, winter is the pink one. I don't know, winner. 
Oi, Summer. Same question. You're freaking right, we mind. Hey, anyone else hungry? So, okay, so they're winter, spring, summer, and autumn. Or fall, or whatever. You shut up, Autumn. Okay, so it is Autumn. Yeah, can't you see we're in the middle of some astute deliberation here? Oh, yeah? Well, your teeth are messed up. Ooh. Super insulting. These four don't get along. I guess that's what happens when all your lower halves are merged into one gross f friggin' nightmare. I thought wolves weren't conjoined together. You better friggin' believe it. It was that stupid sphinx. I told y'all that she was magic. So, hungry. So do you, does that mean you all share a stomach? We used to be free wolves, man. But that gosh darn liver-eyed, yellow-bellied hag of a sphinx stitched us together. I told y'all that she was trouble. That's it! I've heard up to here with y'all. All you guys do is yabber all day. Dang. This is intense. So maybe I talk to you one by one. Figure out. Can't you see we're arguing here? Stay out of this so we can eat you later. Can't you see we're arguing? Okay, so they all stay this. They all say the same thing. Okay, so they're the seasons. That's really cool. So we have to find the Sphinx. What do you say to me? Psst. Hey, ugly! Yeah? Tell them you'll go ask the Sphinx for a cure. It's our only chance for escape. What? You don't believe me? Fine. It's not like I want to be saved by someone ugly like you anyway. Alright. Which one is the leader? You're the leader of the group. I'm sick of you morons dragging me down. You want to talk, Cracker? I never liked any of y'all! Volunteer. Excuse me. Ugh. You better have a real good reason for interrupting. I can ask the Sphinx for a cure. You'll do what? You're crazy or something! She'll eat you alive, man! Yeah, that's our job. But, being free of these fools would be nice. Fine, go talk to the Sphinx. But you'd better come back. Or we'll eat your head. Oi, what about me? We'll be keeping this here till you come back. Gotcha. So I need to go talk to the Sphinx, whoever the Sphinx is. I'm guessing the Sphinx would be... Oh, maybe the Sphinx is the one over in the uh, Kyoto Tower, or whatever it's called, the um, temple. Okay, that this game is so weird, but it's so much it's so much fun. Let's go talk to the Sphinx really quick. Um, That would be... No, I need to get over, and then I need to talk to the owl up north to figure... So, hey... What happened to you? All day, we wait. Wait all day for daddy to come home. That's super creepy. You're cocooning yourself. You're gonna be a giant butterfly, I bet it. Alright, so you. I need your help. It's lunchtime. Which for some reason is nine. Maybe the clock is backwards and I'm just stupid. Alright. That is the right time, right? I'm not stupid. Nope, I am stupid. Lunchtime isn't any time. It's not lunchtime anywhere. No one wants to. No one wants lunch. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. I guess that means that would. Whoops. It's bedtime. Nine o'clock. You dork. I don't dare. Okay, let's go talk to the Sphinx. We just need a cure. She's grumpy, so I'm assuming it's this way. I know I keep compulsively saving, but I really don't want to lose any of the progress that I've made. 
I really, really know. I really, really don't. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. I feel awful. I'm I hope he doesn't hold that against me. Yo, Sphinx. I got a wheat out of a problem. Hey, sweetheart. Ah, the curve returns. Returns? Oh, the girl does not remember? Are you the Sphinx? Someone calls this one that? Yes. But this one calls itself the woman. The girl has come to ask if the woman will separate the wolves, no? How did you know? The girl woman knows many things, but she cannot honor the girl's request. Why not? Vile creatures, wolves. They must pay for what they have done. What exactly did they do? However, it has been too long since the woman has seen a red lava. A what? A red lava? Nothing would make the woman happier. If the girl brings the woman a red lava, then perhaps the woman will separate the wolves. Okay, where can I find a red lava? The girl can find the red lava if she enters the hedge maze. But be warned, the girl may not come back out. Now off she goes. Yes, ma'am. I'll go find you your thing. We're going on 23 minutes, and I don't want these to be as long as Undertale episodes, so I'm going to have to end that there. Just a dramatic little cliffhanger right quick. Just to kind of break the pieces up to make one nice, decent length puzzle. Are you... Are you going to enter the... the maze? You shouldn't. Well, I'm sorry, buddy. I can't take your word for that right now, but I promise I'll come back for you. I swear. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope you stick around, because there will be more to come. Alright, I'll see you in the edge maze, my friends.